are banging these videos out. Um, this is our reaction, initial reaction to the uh, Disney What If series, the Disney Plus What If series, which, um, to my knowledge, um, it's obviously a What If series, uh, but animated. So, you know, I know we saw the trailer where I think it was uh, with the zombie Captain America and like um, I forgot what they what they did with a uh, Black Panther that was super dope. I think I saw some Star Lord stuff in there. Um, I think we see, if I'm not mistaken, in, in the thumbnail for it, it was the Peggy, you know, the Peggy stuff. So that looks super dope, y'all. So like I said, you know, without further ado, let's get into this um, and let's just see let's just see what they bring to the table, y'all. Space, time, reality. It's more than a linear path. It's a prism of endless possibility. Well, that doesn't sound ominous at all. I was promised an army. Okay. You have a super soldier. You sure don't seem too freaked out about all this, kid. What you doing out there all by yourself anyway? Exploring the world. Sounds fun. Yo. But why stop at one world when we can show you all of them? I am the Watcher. Fast new realities. And also, isn't that one of Iron Man's suits? Follow me and dare to face the unknown. And ponder the question. What if? Yo. Give me the tour. Original series streaming soon. So is that supposed to be like um is that supposed to be like uh what am I what am I trying to say? Um uh, so that definitely looked like the Doctor Strange from the live action movies going up against the Doctor Strange, I'm assuming from like the animated movie universe. I don't know. That looks super dope. The animation was was clean. I liked it. The animation was clean. Since it's a what if series, I know it's not gonna have a very like linear storyline. Obviously, it's, it's a what if series. Each episode, it's gonna be its, its own thing, in a sense. Um, but that was super dope. I liked it, y'all. That, that that definitely. Um, I feel like they could do a lot more when it comes to animation. You have a lot more liberty uh, when it comes to what you can do with it, uh, as as you know, as opposed to live action shows where you're kind of restricted because obviously you're a real life human. So you can't really do all that flashy stuff that you could do in an animated uh, movie, or you can't do as a, as much as you would like to. Um, because then it starts to, you know, like no matter how good the CGI is, at, at some point, even the viewer is just like, oh, I feel like they're doing too much. That's just me personally. Maybe you guys aren't like that. Maybe you guys like, maybe you guys like a lot of CGI in your action movies and superhero movies and all that good stuff and you know there's nothing wrong with that you know um it's just not my cup of tea i like there to be a balance between things that are can actually happen and then you know obviously the extra superhero -y stuff but that was dope though i like that i like that a lot that, that was our that was my initial reaction to the um to the what if series um so yeah if you guys uh if you guys like that remember to like comment uh share with all your friends and subscribe if you want more content like this uh Thank you guys for uh, for tuning in and watching our reaction to What If. It's your boy Jerodian. I'm out of here.